Hi guys, welcome back to yet another video. My name is Marcin. I'm filming this in my study tonight. Uh, it's a very cold night out here in Melbourne. Uh, so I'm at home with the heater on and I'm talking comic books. Now, usually on this channel, what I do is I show off four books from random and I end on a key issue. However, I've got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six books. Six books to show off, <clears throat> and I do have a key issue. To, it's a key Spider-Man issue. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have a frog in my throat. Um, now, these are recent pickups uh, in terms of I uh, partook in an online auction, and they arrived here at the house during the week. Uh, but the first one I want to show off is a book I've kind of forgotten that I picked up. It's uh, called Neverland Hook, um, about Captain Hook from the Peter Pan uh, stories. Uh, but it's a bit of a booby book. Uh, not really my taste. I'm more interested to see uh, how they incorporate Captain Hook and maybe even Peter Pan into uh, a Xenoscope story or a Xenoscope uh, comic book. Uh, and yeah, it was a cheap buy. So yeah, there we go. Now, I'm just going to blast through these because they're all pretty much the same. They are X Factor books. Uh, so we have issue 12. Issue 15. Now, this is one of the last times that we see Angel with his wings before he becomes Archangel. Uh, then we have this fantastic cover of X Factor issue 33 with the Beast, looking just absolutely fantastic. Uh, and the last issue we have is X Factor issue 54. Um, and I guess it's a key, it's the first appearance of Crimson. Uh, uh, Crimson? Don't know who that is. Um, but it does have Mark Sil uh, Silvestri on art duties, I think. Let's have a look. I'll open it up because I haven't put the sticky, the sticky tape on it yet. I think it is Mark Silvestri. But yeah, so uh, these were just... Yeah, it is. Mark Silvestri. These uh, X Factor books were just um, issues I needed to fill in the run. I still have a few more issues to go to get the full uh, first volume. But the key issue for this video... Um, it's an underrated uh, key, so this might also go into Letters Comics's uh, undervalued key challenge. Here it is, Amazing Spider-Man issue two twelve. I had to look it up; I, I couldn't even remember two twelve. It's the first appearance of Hydro Man. Um, now I remember when um, Spider-Man Far From Home came out. Was it Far From Home? I think it was. The one where he was in Europe. <laughs> um, yeah, Spider-Man's European Vacation. Uh, <laughs> when that uh, when that movie came out, this book was specced on hard because in the trailer you, th you thought you saw Hydro-Man. Um, and then it was not. It was, it was something else. But yeah, this book was... Uh, it went up, it had a bit of a bump, and now it's back to uh, uh, where, where it is now. Uh, undervalued, uh, but... In terms of Spider-Man and, and especially Mary Jane's story, this is this is a key. Uh, so I'm interested to uh, to read this. I'm very happy to get it. Um, I didn't pay a, a whole lot, but it is the key issue for the video. So that is the video. So thank you for sticking with me. Uh, I hope you appreciate. I hope you appreciate. I appreciate you guys. I hope you've enjoyed these video. These uh these comics. So I need to slow down. <laughs> oh boy, it's been a long day. Okay, thank you for sticking with me. I really appreciate it. Um, please let me know what you think of the comics and of me rambling and stumbling and bumbling because I'm a big fool. <laughs> uh, I've got two more uh, uh, two more videos to film, <laughs> and I need to probably need to go compose myself a little bit. Uh, <laughs> thanks again. I will catch you in the next one.